Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to create a notification on your laptop that your battery has been fully charged. So if you want to receive a notification about it, this tutorial will be for you. So we're going to go ahead and jump right into it, and we're going to start by opening up a notepad file. So just open up the start menu, type in notepad, Best match should come back with Notepad here. I'm going to just left click to open up that program like any other program. And now in the description of my video, I'm going to have a link to a pastebin file or website link. And it's going to have a whole bunch of text. You want to copy whatever is shown in there. And then just right click in a blank area in the Notepad file here. And then left click on Paste. It should look like this when you guys paste it in here. And once you're done pasting it in, you want to go ahead and left click on the file tab up the top left. Left click on Save As. Now underneath Save As Type, you want to click the drop down, select All Files, and then for file name, you can just call whatever you want. I'm just going to call it Battery Indicator, and then do a dot VBS exactly as it appears on my screen here so that's very important and once you're done with that you want to go ahead and left click on save but make sure you save it to a location I'll be able to easily remember where you saved it to so I'm going to save it to my desktop for right now I'm going to click on save and once you're done with that you can close out of here now you want to go ahead and open up the file explorer so open up the start menu or if you have a shortcut on your taskbar you can open that up as well whatever you prefer I know some people don't have one on their taskbar so that's why I'm going to just go through the start menu here I'm going to open up file explorer and now on the left side you want to left click on this PC and then go underneath whatever disk Windows is installed on. So for most people, it should be the C drive. And if you're unsure, there should be a little Windows icon above the hard disk. So you should know. Double click on that. Double click on the Program Files folder. Now you want to left click on the View tab up at the top of this File Explorer window here. Go over to Options and left click on it and then left click on change folder and search options left click on the view tab and underneath hidden files and folders you want to select show hidden files folders and drives and left click on apply and ok now there should be a program data folder that should appear double click on that double click on the microsoft folder double click on windows so scroll down here and we're going to double click on windows like i said and now go and double click on start menu, double click programs, and then double click startup. Start menu, double click on programs, and then you want to double click on startup. Now you want to go ahead and paste this battery indicator or whatever you want to call it into this folder. So just drag and drop it in. Or you could right click copy and then right click and paste. Use a keyboard shortcut if you want. doesn't really matter to me. You just want to get it into this folder here. You will need to provide administrator permissions to move to this folder. Left click on continue. And since I'm on a desktop computer here, it's obviously never going to give me an indicator that the battery is fully charged because, well, there is no battery. But if you restart your computer, it should begin to work at that point. So you can always delete this as well. Just follow the same path that we went up here in the top of the screen. And you just would delete this script file and you'd be back to where you started. So pretty straightforward process here, guys. do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.